Okay guys, hello and today what we're going to do is I'm just, I'm just going to show you this um, this graph that I wrote just based on kind of a recent recent experiences that I've been having um, about sort of scheduling my day and I just want to go through it with you guys because I think it's really interesting. Uh, so you've got to forgive my handwriting, this, this is what it looks like um, and you know I'll, I'll read it all out to you because I know my handwriting is not very good but basically I've, I've got sort of various jobs, various things that I, I, I might or might not do with a day. I've got the high discipline jobs, um, and these are things like doing a deep, bout of deep work, kind of where you're just really, you're really just involved in the work you're doing, you know, time just goes really quickly, like that kind of that really deep work. Then we've got exercise, you know, going to the gym, running, yoga, whatever, stuff like that. Then just like general chores, you know, cleaning up after yourself, you know, whatever, um, cleaning your room, um, you know, showering, brushing your teeth, that kind of stuff. So this is the high discipline jobs. And, you know, may maybe it's not the best term for it, but basically it's like stuff that is not very pleasant. It's quite hard to get yourself to do it, but you're always very thankful when you have done it. Uh, okay, then next we've got the low discipline jobs. Now these are the things that it doesn't actually take a lot of motivation or willpower to do, or a lot of discipline to do. Um, and generally, like, you can do them, and you might afterwards be like, oh, I wish I'd never done those things. Uh, so this is stuff like, you know, uh, just seeing friends. Now, you know, obviously, like, depends on what, you know, the situation, but, like, if you're really busy with something important, you know, you might sort of cancel, you might sort of be forced to cancel friends because you need to get the thing done. Sometimes that's something that you, you have to do, which is, you know... Um, not always a good thing to do, but, I, but you know, generally it doesn't really take willpower to see your friends. That's the important thing. You know, it's quite pleasurable to do. It doesn't take a lot of willpower. You know, going on Netflix, watching a film, you know, another thing on this might be, um, you know, just sort of listening to some music um, in your room, you know, just sort of chilling out. Uh, not, not really doing anything super productive, basically, in the kind of typical measurement. And then the last thing here we've got is what I call the pits. So this is stuff that like, um, is like when you're doing it, it's like, you know it's a shit day. So this is stuff like uh, TikTok. Like when you have a really, just a massive binge on TikTok or Instagram, and you're just on it for hours, you know, and time's just flying and you're like, oh, just five more minutes, five more minutes, and then 15 minutes later, you're still on it. You know, um, watching porn, you know, masturbating like i mean s some masturbating like can be productive can be can be good to do um but generally like it's it just really just depletes your energy levels make leaves you feeling sort of empty inside you know it's never never really a positive thing to do uh, except in the moment and then over here i've got a sort of um line here of like kind of whether I am inclined to do these things or not. So I'm very inclined to, get, you know, do a deep work session, you know, or exercise or, you know, do chores, like, you know, tidy up after myself. Like, you know, um, I don't always um, live up to that ideal. You know, sometimes I won't do very much work, you know, or I won't do as much work as I want to. I know, I mean, I'm, I'm, fe I'm very consistent about exercise, but it's certainly true I might, uh, might um, you know, not go as hard as I, I should or, or I, miss, uh, I miss a session or, or whatever, you know, or I might fail to tidy up after myself, you know. Um, but generally, I think this is stuff that, like, I'm, I'm inclined to do. Now, this stuff is kind of um, stuff that you're not inclined to do. Oh, I'm, I feel very uninclined to do this stuff. Because I know it's not one of these things. I know I know it's not a high discipline job, you know, to sit and watch a Netflix series or, or to like just go for a pint with your with your friends. You know, it's it's quite easy to to motivate yourself to do that. It's quite uh, enjoyable, you know, and it's not, you know, in the traditional sense, very productive. So th what this dip represents here is like I'm just not doing these things at all, you know, um, you know. Well, I mean, generally, um, and last here we've got. The pits. So these are just the terrible stuff. You know, the stuff that, like, is really bad to do. You know, and 
Um, the line's gone up here because, you know, I don't feel inclined to do these things, but life's not perfect. And sometimes I will slip up. I will, you know, go on TikTok for far longer than I, I should, for example, or, or Instagram, you know, far longer than I should. Um, and the point I'm trying to make is, you know, I know, I know that I'm not going to be perfect. I know I'm going to fuck up at a certain point and, you know, do something from, you know, the, you know really, really bad to do. Um, but what I'm thinking is if I fuck up, why not, if I get another pen, um, why not just make it more like this, you know? So, you know, if I do feel sort of weak-minded, I do feel like, because when, when you pick up your phone and like go on, on Instagram Reels, for example, um, or when you, when you masturbate or whatever it is, you know, generally like you feel quite weak-minded in that moment. You're like, oh, fuck it. I, you know, you just, you just give up. You relinquish your willpower, don't you? Um, but, but why not just relinquish, why not go halfway? Why, 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 sort of, why not do a sort of deal with the devil, if you will? Well, not really a deal with the devil, but like negotiate with, with the devil. Why not just instead of, let's, let's say you get a sort of an urge to go on, on TikTok. Why not just go, you know what, actually, I'd love to go on TikTok, but why not? How about I just go on Netflix instead? I'll watch something on Netflix instead. Now, it's still a low discipline job. It's still not super productive. But it's, it's better than going on frying my brain on TikTok for an hour. You know, watching an episode or something on Netflix, you know, same amount of time. You know, it's not the super rewarding deep work activity, but it's much better than going on TikTok. Um, and so this is what I'm trying to do now is just, just put everything into the sort of low discipline jobs, you know, um, because they're not great. It's not great to watch loads of TV, you know, it's not typically super seen as super productive you know it's not typically seen as great to just go to the pub every night um you know but it's better than just doing the really bad stuff you know um like porn like tiktok stuff like that and i just think it's better to just 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 be do, you know it's still not the end of the world you know if if you you know it's almost like oh you know i watch loads of TV yesterday, I finished a series, you know, it's not, it's not the end of the world, you know, you know, in a way that like, if you, if you spend two hours on TikTok, you know, it's just like, that's horrendous, that's awful, you know, you're gonna feel shit the rest of the day, um, you know, these, these things are so much worse than, you know, it'd be easy to kind of bunch, maybe not seeing friends, you know, but, you know, it'd be easy to kind of bunch this all together, you know, watching films, TikTok, um, Insta Reels, but actually, there's a massive difference between these two. There's a massive difference. And actually, there's not such a big difference between these, you know? Uh, especially if you're watching, like, you know, I mean, maybe Netflix is a bad example. But if you're watching a really deep film, you know, if you're watching, like, a proper, like, you know, good film that you really, is really thought-provoking and really interesting, you know, it's still not super productive, but... You know, it's not bad. It's not bad. And it's, it, you know, I, I wouldn't put it in the same league as, you know, watching TikTok. Um, certainly not the same league as, as porn and, and, masturb and masturbation in most cases. So I just think, and, and First Man says this, you know, when he, um, he says when he gets the temptation to masturbate, you know, because he's very into nofap and stuff like that. When he gets the temptation to watch porn or, or masturbate or whatever, He'll just have a cup of tea. He'll just have a nice sugary cup of tea, you know. You know, and then that's not good, that's not great, you know. Caffeine and sugar that's going to disrupt your sleep. You know, sugar that, that's that's you know really unhealthy. Uh, if you have a loss of it, but it's still better than um, than than watching porn. And I just think that is the thing he's that's uh, he's struck on something so key there that just like identify where you're. When you're weak, you know, um, and you just you just decide to give up, you start you decide to give relinquish control. Just do the least bad, just do the most good bad thing that you can do, you know. And that might just be watching a film, 
or you know for him it's having a cup of tea because he's you know that, that's probably a bit of a stretch for most of us right now but you know watching a film you know watching a tv series um you know stuff like that it's like i mean it depends what your sort of vices are you know um because it's different for everyone you know some people are more drawn to different different stuff um you know um much better to do that than get back on track and then you know you might watch a couple of episodes of a film and say you know what, that was great now back to work you know um it's not very likely that you're going to have the same reaction if you're on tiktok for the same amount of time you know or if you watch half an hour's worth of porn you know it's like good luck get going and doing a deep work bout after that uh so just basically guys wherever you can just look for just just negotiate with the sort of bad voices inside of you telling you to do really bad stuff um and you know just just even if it's just a little bit better, you know, it's a little bit less bad, you know, you watch a YouTube video, you know, instead of going on Instagram, you know, still, you know, is that video going to be as insightful as watching like a, a great film? Probably not, but it's still, a, you know, if that's all you can get yourself to do, that's fine, you know, that's fine. Um, and just start seeing long term with discipline as much as possible. So there you go, guys. That's my, that's my um, graph for you. Um, I will have a PDF version so you can print it out and and put it on your walls. No, I ain't joking. I'm not going to do that. Um, but yeah, that's the video, guys. Thanks very much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.